today i am going to talk about the human specific machine of isro disclaimer in this presentation i'll be talking about the, the gaganyaan mission the technology developed for gaganyaan human specified around the world collaborating agencies the mission profile and its benefits gaganyaan gaganyaan is a sanskrit word which means sky vehicle gagan means sky and yaan means vehicle gaganyaan is india's third mission to space it will carry three yam nodes or gagan nodes american space travelers are called astronauts russian space travelers are called cosmonauts chinese space travelers are called taikonauts and indian space travelers are called vyomonauts specifications gaganyaan is a crewed spacecraft with a launch mass of 8200 k kilograms it has a drive mass of 3735 kg it can carry three vehicles for 3 to 7 days in the low earth orbit it has a total volume of 8 cubic meters technologies we are developing a variant of lvm3 which will be called as hlvm3 we have also constructed a human spaceflight center space suits and space medicines are being developed together by india and france there is also a plan for constructing a third launch pad for launching human spaceflight missions at sjt shar biomitra a humanoid robot was developed to assist the humanoids the astronaut training facility has been constructed in bengaluru a lot of testing is done for this mission the human rated lvm3 or hlvm3 has a decrease as 200 chamber pressure of 56.5 ksc it has a slight nozzle modification the chamber pressure of the l110 core stage has decreased to 58.5 bars the cryogenic upper stage ce20 engine has decreased in thrust for, from 196.5 kN to 186.3 kN hlvm3 has a crew escape system while lvm3 has a fairing biomitra biomitra is a female looking humanoid robot developed by isro instead of animals we use robots for the better understanding of microgravity and the effects of radiation on the human body biomitra can talk in hindi and english It will accompany the humans on crewed missions and will also be used in uncrewed experimental flights. Spacesuit. The spacesuit contains one oxygen cylinder and a flight suit and LCG with a total of seven layers: an outer cover layer, a thermal insulation layer, a restraint layer, a pressure bladder, an outer layer of LCG, a middle layer of water circulation tubes, and an inner layer of LCG. LCG stands for liquid cooling and ventilation garment. third launch pad the third launch pad is planned to be constructed at the Sutter Space Center in Helicopter Range for future crewed missions space medicine and human space flight center the medical personnel for the gaganyaan mission will be trained by the french space agency cnes the defense food research laboratory will prepare the space food and g suits for the humanoids experiments experiments related to microgravity will be conducted on earth at the human space flight center crew members indian prime minister narendra modi unveiled the four vyomana designates at vikram sarabhai space center kerala on 27th february 2024 the selected individuals are group captain prashant balakrishnan nayar group captain ajit krishnan group captain angad pratap wing and wing commander subhansu shukla orbital module the orbital module consists of two parts the crew module and the service module the crew module is a place where the humanoids will stay the service module contains a power and propulsion system the crew module has a heat shield for reentry as well as a hatch door with a view port the service module has five aerators and voltaic panels and also has engines for in orbit maneuvering the service module has a primary storage of oxygen and nitrogen as well as the radiators in order to vent out the heat the crew module has secondary tanks of oxygen and nitrogen and an air revitalization system there is also a carbon dioxide removal system testing the major tests conducted for this mission were car crew model atmospheric reentry experiment a pad about tests and the tests of the hu human rated engines the other major tests which were conducted are an in flight about test of the crew escape system about the test vehicle d1 or tvd1 the drogue parachute deployment tests were also conducted at terminal ballistics research lab in chandigarh 
human space flight around the world. India will become the fourth nation after the Soviet Union or Russia, America, and China to send a man into space. Mission profile. The Guardian will lift off from Shihari Kota and it will take 16 minutes to reach low Earth orbit. It will deploy its solar arrays and stay for 6 to 7 days in space. Then it will reorient itself and perform a de-boost maneuver. Then the separation of the crew and service modules will happen. After re-entry phase, the parachutes will be deployed and a safe splashdown will happen at the Arabian Sea of Gujarat. The launch will happen from Srihari Kota. The splashdown will happen in the Arabian Ocean. The crew module will be recovered in 15 to 20 minutes. Benefits Gagarin mission enhances the science and technology levels of our country and improves industrial growth in India. Gagarin inspires youth to take challenges in society and in science and technology. It provides way for international collaboration and policies. These are the collaborating agencies. Thank you.